So with Season of the Lost, we got a new linear fusion rifle called Lawrence Driver, and at first, everyone thought it was completely overpowered, Bungie nerfed it soon after, and then it kind of just disappeared into obscurity, which is cool, but while it was overpowered, no one mentioned this one thing that it's capable of doing, which in my opinion, kind of makes it one of the best near fusion rifle in the game right now. Like this one synergy literally put it above things like sleeper stimulant for me. For me personally, obviously your mileage may vary, but this this one thing really does make this an extremely good linear fusion rifle. This season, disclaimer, it is only for this season. Once the season's over and the seasonal mods are gone, unfortunately, Lawrence probably won't be like my top linear fusion rifle. But for right now, it's definitely up there. Now, if you're new to the game, Lawrence Driver is an exotic linear fusion rifle that we got this season that comes with the exotic perk Lagrangian Sights. This weapon marks targets with an automated targeting system. Final blows on marked targets create a telemetry pattern. Collecting three telemetry patterns without dying grants this weapon bonus damage for a long duration. Now this duration is actually pretty darn long. It is 30 seconds of increased damage, right? And I'm pretty sure, I think it's like, a 50% damage boost, if I'm correct. I'm not sure. I'm not really into numbers and all that stuff when it comes to damage bonuses. All I know is it's a lot of damage bonus, right? But it also comes with the other exotic perk, which is EM Anomaly. Now this is what we're going to be really taking advantage of in today's build. EM Anomaly states that a precision final blow with this weapon creates an implosion that pulls in nearby targets and damages them with an additional detonation. So basically how it works is when you get a precision kill with this weapon, it will create a like suction little vacuum and then that vacuum will explode doing void damage. Now, the armor piece that we're gonna be pairing with this is Nezarek Sin, which comes with the exotic perk Abyssal Extractors, void damage kills, increase ability energy recharge rate. So with the explosions from the EM Anomaly, that counts as void damage kills, which means you will be able to proc the Abyssal Extractors. Now the thing about this is usually the EM Anomaly is gonna get you multi-kills, right? That's what you, that's the purpose of EM Anomaly is to get you multi-kills with that explosion or implosion rather, which means you'll be proccing a stacked effect of Abyssal Extractors. And I've actually gotten like 20, like 18 to 20 seconds of that increased recharge rate. Now obviously with the variable cooldowns that we have now it's gonna you know your mileage is gonna vary depending on what abilities you're using but to have that increased ability energy recharge rate is gonna be beneficial for honestly any subclass right but now it is time for us to talk about Lawrence drivers little secret synergy or synergy that no one's really talking about and that is EM anomaly does something really special with particle deconstruction now particle deconstruction is a seasonal mod in our artifact that states dealing damage to a combatant with a fusion rifle or linear fusion rifle grants bonus damage with a linear fusion rifle or fusion rifle against that combatant for a short duration this effect stacks up to five times which means you can get a stack a full five stack of this bonus damage on one target now what is cool about this and Lawrence Driver is that Lawrence Driver's EM Anomaly actually causes this to be an AOE effect. Now what's cool about this is with the exotic catalyst for Lawrence Driver, once you get three telemetries, you will have not only increased damage, but your EM Anomaly won't proc on precision kills, they will just proc on kills in general. Now if you can't tell where I'm going with this, Basically, what we're doing is we are stacking a lot of bonus damage passively, right? We have things like Lagrangian Sights giving us that 50% bonus damage. We have Particle Deconstruction giving us bonus damage as well. But we can also stack on more damage. Things like High Energy Fire and Font of Might actually stack with Lagrangian Sights and Particle Deconstruction. But the cool thing about this is with all this bonus damage, and things like GMs, usually the EM Anomaly would not be able to, you know, kill uh, red bars, unfortunately. But with this bonus damage added onto it, you will be able to get a lot of multi-kills, meaning that the Abyssal Extractors from Nezrak Sin will proc more often in in-game content. 
which means that you will be able to recharge your abilities even faster. Now, this can be paired with any subclass, but for this build personally, I am pairing it with Stasis because there's one more thing I want to take advantage of with Lawrence Driver, and that is Explosive Wellmaker, right? Now, obviously, you can do this with any other subclass, but the thing about Stasis is that with Explosive Wellmaker, Stasis Shatter Damage actually procs it as well. On top of the fact that EM Anomaly procs the Explosive Wellmaker, meaning that you can make Solar Wells to recharge things like your grenade, which you can use to use more Bleak Watcher turrets faster. So you're getting that benefit of crowd control with stasis, as well as being able to, you know, recharge your abilities and take advantage of Explosive Wellmaker. So that is it for today's build. Hopefully, you know, you guys use this. Let me know what you guys use in combination with it down in the comments below. But uh, yeah, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. I thought I'd share this little discovery I made um, as I really have not seen any other creators talk about this. I'm not sure if maybe like it's just not good to other people, but to me it's amazing that you know Lawrence Driver is able to do an AOE particle deconstruction effect like that. That blows my mind. Like honestly, like even in this footage, you guys can see that I'm actually you know stacking that particle deconstruction on multiple enemies. So uh, yeah, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, hit that like button. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.